Despite the rain, how have spirits been today around the pit? Good. More than you would ever imagine. <laughs> In the rain. In the rain. So yeah, it's definitely got a buzz about it. I think this weekend's gonna be wild. I don't think the rain affected anybody. Everyone put their jackets on, put their umbrellas up, and then kept tooting on their vuvuzelas. And they're all still here, they didn't go home. So I don't think it dampened anybody's spirits. It's good, we can see the end of the track and people are starting to come through, do some adjustments. It's good, we're happy. I'm seeking validation right now. Okay. <laughs> it feels good, but if there's something that you think is not feeling good? I haven't ridden it. But in that uh, feeling, it is rough. Okay. I'm noticing it in the hands. And it's definitely, it's the same as once an end, so. Okay. Does the uh, extra day of practice change your strategy at all, or what um, are you thinking? I think the extra day of practice just gives you kind of more stuff to think about, honestly. If it was, uh, if it was race day, I wouldn't be here talking to Jordy, so. Yeah, I mean, definitely better to get used to the track more, and I think it's going to rain, so. Just kind of helps for, you know, getting to know that track extra bit. Cool! <laughs> Ooh, that's a different though. Uh, and? You can tell me what you did or no? Yeah, I, I just sped up the rear a lot on low speed. We might need to slow down high speed next run, but feels fine. Okay. okay. Cool. Thank you. I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, we'll try that. Thanks, just sped his shock up a lot. It was really, really slow with low speed rebound. I don't know why. So just got it closer to where it should be and, and then we'll see how the run goes. But yeah, it was definitely slow. What I needed. Because now I'm coming full speed into compressions and I ex I'm expecting this kick and it's not coming so I can hit it even faster. It's pretty stable. Um, I like I stopped on the lake and was like, fuck, this is another level of speed at the moment. The only thing is, I'm sometimes working myself a bit in the bike, feeling. I mean, okay. maybe this is the this is the compromise now. Like that, that I'm like that I sometimes feel it doesn't recover fast enough on like straights when it gets a bit steep, and then I'm like doing this, 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 okay. and then experience when we open the rebound, I can stand a bit higher on the bike. Um, but I would, okay. I would, I think I would leave it like this. Okay. It's just like two, three sections where I'm, I need to be aware of now to not work myself into okay. the bike. Because we could open low, just one, one click again. if you want to try it. Low speed or low. Yeah, then let's maybe do this. Yeah. But it was such a huge difference. Good. Like, I felt like faster than yesterday's qualities and more in control. Getting ready! <laughs> Just track conditions like a bunch of mid to three quarter hits. So it's like constantly on the shock and slowing it down a little bit more is just helping like keep the chassis a little more neutral. But I think we're, we're close. Sounds like she feels good. I really like it now. Okay. I think it's like you could end up going up a bit in forward pressure if you wanted to. Yeah. Because you're burying it pretty deep. Okay. But if if you're good with it, but yeah, it might I mean, be something to think about for race run if weather stays consistent. No, it feels sick. Okay. Just like a lot more control about how speed it feels. Okay. Good. So. Sweet. Thank you. Okay. Get out there. Oh yeah. You're happy. Uh, it's still like, it just seems harsh, eh? Do you reckon like, try and go a bit softer? 
front and back or just back? No one I don't know, just like, just in general? Yeah, it's like, I don't know. Just like, feels like I get a lot of feedback through the bicycle. The our bikes are very stiff as well. Yes. <laughs> I think. A lot of it's like that you're hitting like stuff you don't really know is there. So like it's a surprise. I definitely noticed that because we slowed it down a touch. Yeah. Yeah. And that was like less. I wasn't getting like as, as bucky. Bucky. But um. But yeah. Yeah. Try. Yeah. And don't change sport just this. No. Let's see. Try that first. Yeah, I'm gonna do like three runs, so I'll just swing back out. Oh, cool. Okay. Yeah. Living like this. I thought you were going for pastries. Pardon? <laughs> How about it? Now that you mention it. No. Athlete, I wouldn't eat that. I threw in that volume spacer for the shock, and then I lowered the PSI by 10. So 10 PSI lower. I'm liking how Sags are running, but it's just like. Does not wouldn't mind it like just going through. It seems like it's not going through all the travel a bit more. But I take away. That's what a volume spacer does. But I take away some high speed then. Where are you on high speed? I think I'm I'm around I'm like five on high speed and low speed. So it's similar. So open that up a bit. Yeah, we'll try. We'll just open it a couple clicks. Cause you're already open on low speed. I go. Oh, okay. All the most of the way. Yeah. And then just yeah, okay. yeah. Cause I was like, I was like, how it's like holding me up, like with the PSI. But then it's just like, so I could feel it some bit, so it's just like still like okay. a bit too much. But I was last first run, and it was yeah. pretty, yeah, pretty icy. But uh, now nah, give that a shot anyway. There's that. How'd the day go around the pit? Well, it rained like it has at every other race. <laughs> the track got absolutely terrifying, like just zero grip, super hard pack. So only that surface dust got saturated and then it was just like a layer of soapy water on top of hard pack. I haven't heard lately. I think it's dried out a bit because it stopped raining. It only rained for about an hour, hour and a half, I think and not a lot. And the ground here does dry up pretty quickly. I think we're looking good. The Hoff was pretty stoked. She was fired up. Yeah, we got Amory's flying. Bernie's still doing good. Dude, Tebow's flying. Tebow's flying, those Man. guys. <laughs> it's gonna be wild tomorrow. Do you, have you seen the forecast for tomorrow? It's clear, it looks clear. If it stays dry, it's going to be amazing because it should dry out enough that it'll be nice and tacky, but not super dusty. Maybe. Well, it's currently about 7.30 p.m. I'm just uh, doing some editing here and this is what's happening outside. So I certainly have no idea what tomorrow holds, but I do know it's going to be a party. So we'll see you then. There's all these zombie theories, but nobody thinks it comes from dysentery. Oh no. Could just poop your way into being a zombie. <laughs>